सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति वंदे गुरुपद द्वंदन भक्त बिंद समन्वित श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंद वन मनोहर वाछा कल्पतरुव के पास सिंधु पतितान पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुखति बाचाल पंगुंगल हेतगिरी यत्तमहंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव पिया वै केशव सच भक्ति पदे देवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नर चरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जय मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीयपत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदरुण ध्येय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदूहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचन तम शरण्यम भीताहम पुनुतपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणारिंद यदपल्लवन खचंदमनीटा विस्फुर्जीत किमी गुबूदर्श पूर्णागरस सागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयी कदा श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद सियादगदाधर शिवासादी गौरभक्तविंद श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद श्रीअद्वैत गदाधर शिवासादी गौरभक्तविंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनुका बुदा संकीर्तन कपितरो कमलायुताक्ष विशाबरो द्विजरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तव पादुपंकज सुरासुरवंदी तो दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दधासी नीथ भावाण सदा नरान गंगा तरंगरमणीयटाकलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तो बाम भाग नारायण प्रियमनंगुमदापहारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशजुष वदने लक्ष्मीजस् चक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संवीत सिंह भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 
अथापिते पदाबुजोदयो प्रसाद लेश अनुगृहत एव हि जानाति तथ्यम भगवान महिम्न न चेको चिरन विचिन्म अथा पीते पदाबुजोदयो प्रसाद लेश अनुगृहत एव हि जानाति तथ्यम भगवान महिम्न न चेको चिरन विचिन्म गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी रूप भोपाल परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट By personal effort, nobody can realize Bhagavat Tattva. Ishwarer ki palais hai to jahare, sahi to Ishwat Tattva jani vare pare. What I told in yesterday, Nila Chale, Gopinatha Jaju speaking. Without the mercy of Bhagwan, without the mercy of Guru Vishnu, we cannot understand. Bhagavat Tattva by your personal effort. Pobat speaking, there is two type of procedure. One is challenging mood, one in, one is challenging procedure, and another, another is submissive attitude. Two procedure are there. Pobat give an example, like those you know, baby cat. Baby cat. Mother going to take with teeth taking the baby cat and going to put somewhere else. And monkey baby, monkey baby always going to catch mother and mother can jump from here and there. Any time baby can fall down. This kind of accident usually happening. In Vrindavan, we have seen baby cat, mother jumping, baby cat lose hand grip and fall down and die. Papa giving this example, very nice example, so that we can throw out all our false ego. That's why Papa giving this example. Monkey baby, if going to lose grip, then can fall down. There is risk, but baby cat, mother going to take the responsibility to take from from here to there. There is no risk, mother going to take. Similarly, those who are going to depend upon kripa mercy, those who are going to depend upon the causeless mercy of Bhagwan. Hey Guru Pad Padmo, if you like to calculate. If there is any qualification in me or not, then I am disqualified. Follow. If Guru Dev going to think, let me see, he has his uh, qualification or not, then I, I can never become qualified. Jogota bichare kichu nahi pai tomara corona sar. If if Guru Pramod no like to calculate, if there is any capacity or quality, then I am disqualified. It is only his causeless mercy, by the help of which I can keep hope. He can, but there is one vital point. If I have no quality, if I have no quality, nothing, still okay, I can get Bhagwan. If I am totally layman, I have nothing, no idea, no education, nothing, I am useless. But if there is only one single quality, that is called submission. That is called submission. If there is submission in my life, then everything can be done. If there is submission, if there is no submission, then whatever quality, however quality is there, I cannot come out successful. So yesterday I was speaking. Those self-effulgent objects, you cannot put pressure. I cannot say, I will have to do Harinam. I have no, no time. I, I can do Harinam. Harinam you can do? This kind of false ego? I can do Harinam. Achha, you can do Harinam. You have your power to do Harinam. We are speaking this way. I can do Harinam. No time I have. <laughs> harinam nobody can do. Harinam can appear. I cannot do Harinam. 
It is one kind of false ego. Because I told the other day that Harinam and Hari all same. Prabhupada used to say, to do Harinam and to meet with Hari all the same. So what is the meaning of my Harinam? Important it's all. That's why this is one kind of false ego that I can do Harinam. I cannot do. Harinam can appear by watching my submission, by watching my submission unto the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, by watching my love for Bhagavan, Guru Vaishnava, Dham, Nam, out of causeless mercy can appear in my tongue and by the power of Saru Shakti, somehow I can utter Harinam. And one Harinam, if appear, then you can cut everything. Pure Harinam, the result of pure Harinam is not, is not, uh, you know, is not uh, the meaning that you will have to get free of Maya. Get free of Maya, you can, you can do it by Namabhas. Pure name means Krishna Preva. Pure name means you can get Krishna Preva. Anyway, so personal effort is Useless, you cannot do. That's why demigods they are speaking. If somebody like to get your kipa, if he can go on trying for infinity period, still he or she cannot come out successful. If depending upon the mercy, a bit mercy of a lotus feet, then he can come out successful. I was speaking yesterday. How Brahma, by his personal effort, was totally failure. Totally failure. Finally, he was bound to speak, Jnane prayasa mudapasya namanti eva ivanti sanmukharitam bhavadiyo vartam sanestita sutigatam tonubang manuvir je prayasa ajito jito ajito pi jito pi osi toistri lokyam. You are never conquered by anybody. Nobody can conquer you, but you can be conquered. When he can leave all his personal effort, Gane Prayasa Mudapaso, I cannot play my head anymore. Because my brain is material, my mind is material, my body is material, my thoughts are material, all material. So material things cannot approach towards God, towards Supreme Lord. Even my body, matter, matter, is matter actually. Is prakriti. Anybody, male, female, anybody. Is matter, it is matter actually. But people are in confusion. Oh, what is this? Is matter actually. Main thing is Atma there, that's why it is working. Mahaprabhu giving example like one iron bar, iron stick or iron bar is uh, blackish in color and cold, iron is not. Then if you are going to put that iron bar into fire for long time, then the property of fire can enter into the iron bar and now you can see, discover the iron body red is in color, glowing, molten gold. At the same time, iron by iron, that iron bar at present can burn anything. Usually our iron bar can usually iron bar can never burn anything. But when in while in contact with fire, getting power from fire, now can burn anything. Same example Mahaprabhu giving to Sanatana Goswami that all matter, all alone, everything what you see matter. Your body matter, even mind matter, your intellect, your mind, everything matter. Matter, matter, matter. My, my mind is matter, yes. Fine matter. You cannot see, but it is matter. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking in Gita. Bhumi rapa analo khang mano, bhumi rapa analo bayu khang mano buddhi revacha, ahankar ityamme prakriti rastra. Bhagavan speaking to Arjun, 
my prakriti, my nature, in eight different part, in eight different part, working in this material world. This mud, bhumi, rapo, water, eh, vayu, khang, akas, all everything, fire, everything. And even your mind, what you are, you are playing your mind now, in your brain, all matter at present. But not that you cannot do Krishna Bhajan. You can do Krishna Bhajan, provided you are able to change your mind. Someday your mind can become a prakito. Follow. Today's matter, you are trying. You are not going to live by continuous effort, continuous restless effort, non-stop effort. Someday you can discover your mind is a prakito. Someday, not now. If you go on trying, hearing arikata, hearing arikata, digesting, not that only hearing, thinking what I hear, and try to catch and try to apply, you know, then someday you can discover your mind, your brain, everything a prakito. Same thing I told you in a Bhyad Bhagavad Gita. Same thing in Bhyad Bhagavad Gita, Sanatana Gosai is speaking. Krishna Bhakti Sudha Panat Deho Doihi Kavisrite Tesam Pancho Bhautik Deho Pi Satchidananda Rupata. Krishna Bhakti Sudha Panat Krishna Bhakti Rasa Krishna Bhakti Rasa, you are continuously drinking. Krishna Bhakti Sudha Amrat Amrita Krishna Bhakti Sudha Panat Then you can forget about your material body and body related thing you can forget you can forget bhakti mr thakur it seems bhakti mr thakur in the material world but bhakti mr thakur is not there bhakti mr thakur many time it happened not one time everybody knows bhakti mr thakur arranging some kirtan sahaja kirtan it is one kind of trap to catch public. And he himself sitting in the asan. He is himself sitting in the asan. And that Lila Kirtan going on. So by hearing, by he hearing Kirtan, all outside public coming to hear. And they are watching Bhakti Muttaku sitting, also hearing Kirtan. But Bhakti Muttaku not hearing that Kirtan. Because that is Sahaja Kirtan. Purposely Bhakti Muttaku, it is one kind of trap. They call Bhakti Muttaku. And he is doing Harinam, he pass away. I mean to some other. Vaikuntu Jaga. Many times it happens so. One day, one of our Guru Bhargava coming to Sananda Sukhata Kunja, I mean there, Bhakti Muttaku Bhajan Kutir, to meet with Bhakti Muttaku. That time, almost 24 hours, Bhakti Muttaku used to do Harinam absorbingly. Closing eyes and Gaur Gadadhar, small vigraha, Gaur Gadadhar in a cavity, a small wall cavity. There Gaur Nityananda, Bhakti Muttu sitting here, whole day doing her, closing eyes. And in a day, only two or three times, Sebab forcefully give him some milk, not eating anything. Whole day doing her. And one of our Guru Bhargava, uh, coming to meet with him. Follow. One day coming. Then the Sebok, Sebok speaking, where from you are coming? I am coming actually, uh, Bhimalapasa Saraswati, send me, Prabhupada send me. Acha. Uh, I like to take darshan of the lotus feet of Bhakti Thakur. Well, you wait, let me go. First of all, Seva going up and repeatedly with folded hand, repeatedly with folded hand, repeatedly speaking, Thakur, Thakur is calling. Thakur cannot hear. Thakur, repeatedly after speaking, then giving response. Somebody coming to take your darshan and kipa. Bhimala Prasad Saraswati Prabhupada. 
he giving some gesture bring after coming when our, that guru varg that particular guru varg i am going to not to, is paying pram pranam then bhakti mun thakur opening eye this way and watching close eyes is close all the time forcefully open and watching forcefully and guru that guru varg is speaking i have never seen this kind of sight when he look at me i see something supernatural not ordinary man ordinary man can look at each other but they have no no look at me this way as if going to give full mercy to me so mercy so bhakti mun thakur prabhupad sita pandu sidur go sima bhakti mun puri all are, most of all guru bangu se maharaj absorbing it seems they are busy with busy here but actually they are thinking about bhagwan doing leela all seva in kirtan sometime we are playing madanga and speaking it is a direct feeling of bhakti mun thakur but we should understand our limit our quality according to that we should do kirtan i am not sahajiya maybe i am not sadhu perfect but i am at least i am not sahajiya so i can so you can do this kirtan somebody in front of me when do, doing this kirtan kabe bolo kabe hobe bolo se dino amar dhano jano ar kobita sundari bolibo na chahi deho sukho kori janme janme prabhu deho gauro hori अहेतु की भक्ति चरणे तो मार कब हम बोलो से दिन दिस कीर्तन इज वेरी हाई लेवल कीर्तन वेरी हाई लेवल भक्ति मन ठाकुर प्रेई भक्ति मन ठाकुर प्रेई वेन आई कैन गेट दिस कैंड ऑफ स्टेज प्लेटफॉर्म वेन आई कैन थिंक ऑल अबाउट यू ऑल लील आई कैन एपियर इन फ्रंट ऑफ मी वेन आई कैन गेट दिस कैंड ऑफ गोल्डन अपॉर्चुनिटी वेन कब है बोलो से दिन हमार वे धन मैन पावर मानी पावर ऑल आ प्योर वैष्णव इफ यू लाइक टू टेस्ट इफ यू आर इन चैलेंजिंग मूड इफ यू लाइक टू टेस्ट यू कैन सी आ प्योर वैष्णव नेवर डिपेंड अपन एनी बॉडी इट सीम्स दे आर डिपेंडिंग इट सीम्स ऑल बाय द मार्सी ऑफ भगवान दे आर डूइंग एवरीथिंग दे आर डूइंग सो absorbingly when you are, i know some matajis one or two or three so many matajis i know even in the temple of parambhu sidhar goshi maharaj krishna mai mataji she used to stay in our temple old lady very old lady always thinking bhajan in bindavan one mataji old old mataji she used to do absorbing bhajan not from goriamar not from goriamar but goriya society maybe from genuine sadhu she took diksha you know absorbing doing whole day he is watching krishna lila and writing he is writing what he is watching you cannot imagine what kind of writing in my life i have not seen i have in my whole life i am not seen even a single poet who has his power or her power to write that way i have that i have book also i have when i open the book i find direct krishna is there how possible impossible to write even rabindranath tagore or big big writer they cannot write that way big big writer world famous nobel laureate they cannot write whereas nobody know her name i by chance i know her name by chance i know her name nobody but he is writing in such a way as if directly aprakita saraswati अप्राक सरस्वती हर सब लाइटिंग इच स्टॉप डॉट इच वर्ड इज ए रिदिम 
I say, how possible? As if Bhagavan directly inside and giving inspiration. Like the case of Jayadev Goswami. Do you think Jayadev Goswami writing some material writing? Jayadev Goswami writing? Jayadev Goswami. Why are you writing? Pralaya payadi jalya dhito banasi vedam. This. Eh? Jayadev Goswami writing? Huh? Ke sabadhita, meena sarvira, jai jagadhisa hari. So do you think it is a material writing? It's not material writing. He is writing so many things about Jagannath, Panda. Still today, those pandas singing, morning time before opening gate. Sita kamala kuchak, this kirtan. Roj morning time, before opening gate, Jagannath. In front of Jagannath, the pandas, they are kids sitting in queue and they are singing this. So, absorbingly they are in Hari Bhajan. When you are absorbingly in Hari Bhajan, then you cannot remember your body and body related thing. Like I told now, Shukdev Goswami asking Rajan, you are thirsty, you are hungry. You are not taking rest. Why not you go and take rest? I take rest. No, I am not thirsty. I am not tired. I am not feeling feeling sleepy. Not because I am drinking nectar. Pivantam tan mukham bujam harikatham. Pivantam tan mukham bujachutam harikatham ritam. I am drinking nectar. So. Whenever somebody hearing Harikatha absorbing way, he can get a big reaction inside body. So, today your mind, heart, everything material. But not that forever you have taken resolution for a, you have taken resolution that forever I can stay in materials, materials, what your father can do. You have taken resolution, I like to stay in material platform. What your father can do, I like to stay, then I have nothing to do. But it is a must. After hearing Harikatha continuously, absorbing way, if you go deep, you can, you can forget everything about your body and body related thing. That's why Svanathana Gusai was writing, Krishna Bhakti Sudha Panad Deho Doihi Kovisrute Tesham Pancho Hotik Dehopi Externally, the body of Paramahya Siddhar Goswami Maharaj is material. I like me, same body. Externally, it's the same body, like me. Not same. So, Nathan Goswami is speaking, externally, it's a material body, like me. But not at all same. Chinma, your prakita sarir appear. It's same material, but not material. From morning time after Aruti is over, Maharaj used to speak Harikatha. Morning time, Aruti. Morning time, Aruti is over. Birds, you know, singing in different branches of the trees. Then all devotees coming and sitting in front of Maharaj. Maharaj absorbingly Hari doing Harinam. When realize some devotees coming, he start doing Hari, speaking Harikatha. After that, from 10 o'clock, 12, after that, noon time, 2 to 4, again, <laughs> oh, whole day Harikatha. Oh, hundreds of people come to meet with Maharaj. And Maharaj go and speak. How possible? So, Krishna Bhakti Shuddha Panad Deho Daihi Kavisrite Te Sam Pancho Bhotik Deho Opi Satchidanda Rupa. It's same material body, but actually not material body. Somebody can put challenge for him. I gave one example long ago. One, one actually uh, an office in charge, maybe director, not office in charge, is sitting in his room of one big office. And after some time, I mean in the noontime break, I mean lunch time, moon time, he is writing one letter and letter is kept in the table 
one of his friends enter the room and he what you are doing i am actually writing one letter to whom to my to my brother younger brother acha okay that time there was no system of mobile nothing follow so i is writing and uh, when the discussion is over when the friend going outside is speaking well can you take trouble to drop this letter in the post box he sure why not is taking the letter is seeking the address of the letter is central jail central jail alipur calcutta your brother staying in jail you told you are writing letter to your brother yes i am writing brother but his address is jail yes address is jail address is jail because those who are prisoner they are staying in jail by mother my my brother is a is a superintendent of that jail the externally address is same externally the address of sidhar go same maharaj is material world externally address your address is also material world but actually not so they are staying here they are staying here to deliver us and we are staying here to enjoy material material things we are staying here to enjoy material world whereas they are staying to deliver us that is the difference so this way we challenging mood we can never come out successful we challenging mood we can never come out successful that's why i told you yesterday brahma when discover himself in the lotus flower then thinking who am i who am i is thinking all around see all around after that cannot understand stand then taking trouble to come down through the stem of the lotus flower there is stem of lotus flower no? come down you cannot trace out the reason again going up even go down he cannot search out any reason who am i where from i come what is my purpose what is my purpose what for i am coming is thinking immediately he hear from tapa 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 and by inspiration of bhagwan he could realize what is the meaning of tapa he started doing tapasya anyway bhagwan was satisfied with his tapa bhagwan was anyway satisfied with his tapasya and after that bhagwan appear bhagwan giving him darshan mentally giving darshan and speaking that i like to give you dibba gyan dibba gyan mean bhagwan like to give initiation to brahmana dibba gyan mean ki he said i like to give you some transcendental knowledge of prakrita gyan so you can accept it by your personal effort you can never accept so bhagwan speaking that is the teachings of chatur shloki bhagavatam that is the teachings of chatur shloki four shloka bhagavatam bhagwan speaking to brahma gyanam paramam guhyam me yat vigyana samannitam sarhasam tadangancha tadangan gyan guditam maya javana ham yatha bhavo yad rup gun karma kah tathaiva tatva vigyanam asutte madano grahat this way all bhagwan sri javan aham yatha bhavo yad rup gun karma kah tathaiva vigyanam asutte madano grahat अहम एवास में वग्रे नज सहसत्म पश्चात हम जदि तच जो स्वस्मी स्वस्मी अहम रीति अर्थम यद प्रतीत न प्रतीत चात्मनि तद्विद्वा आत्मा मैं यथावास यथात्म यथा महांति भूता भूतेषु उच्चावशि शुनो प्रविष्टा न प्रविष्टा न तेषु न तेषु अहम ऑल भगवान गोइंग टू इन जिस्ट ऑल वास्ट इन्फिनेटी नॉलेज इन्फिनेटी नॉलेज भगवान गोइंग टू स्पीक Brahma stand. Bhagwan speaking. Prabhupad explaining. Now Prabhupad explaining that when Bhagwan wanted to give this Chatur Sloki Bhagavatam, which is a complete knowledge, it's a complete. 
Then Bhagavan speaking, Brahma, I know you are powerful. You have four head, so much power. But be sure, by your personal effort, you can never know. This knowledge is very secret. Secrets of the secrets. So secret that I can quote one sloka from Bhagavatam where our Yamaraja, one among twelve Mahajan, from our Yamaraja, he is speaking. His knowledge is so secret that guhyam vishuddhyam durvadhyam yad gyatya amritam asnute. Guhyam vishuddhyam, oh pure, durvadhyam. First of all, speaking, guhyam, secrets of the secret. In course of travelling infinity world for infinity period, Nobody, never can get this knowledge. Life after life, you traveling, I am traveling, who not? All Jivatma. All Jivatma. You are making an unstable relationship with wife, children, everything, all, and going to put you inside jail. I am not speaking you throw out. I am not speaking that. You can keep it, but realize they are nothing. I have no relationship with them eternally. It is only for some days. At the age of 25, you marry one Mataji. Okay? After that, at the age of 80, you are living. So, 25, 80 minus 25. How much? For that, during that period, you grow relationship with Before and after, but people so intelligent, they cannot understand this simple point. They are so intelligent, they cannot understand simple point. Hello? The guiham, secrets of the secret. Vishuddhyam, very pure. This knowledge is so pure, totally pure. Durvadhyam, intricate subject matter. So, your brain cannot catch it. Guyam, Guyam, Vishuddham, Durvadhyam. Actually, from Upanishad, I can discuss this point someday. That this knowledge is kept secretly inside a golden pot, covered up, sealed up, sealed, you know, bank locker sealed up. Who can open this seal? Who can get this knowledge? Hello. Hiran Mayina Patrina Satasha Apahitam Mukham Upanishad. Hiran Mayina. Noon time I can discuss. Not all at a time. Not possible. Hiran Mayina Patrina Satasha Apahitam Mukham. This secret property is kept so secretly that nobody never can understand. Impossible. So, Jyamaraji Maharaj is speaking. It is Guiham, Vishuddham, Durva, the intricate. Nobody can understand. What is this? Jyadgyatta. But sure, but be sure, after getting this Amrita, you can never come back in this painful world. After getting this Amrita, you can never come back in this material world. You can get free forever. So what do you prefer? You like to be in the trap of Maya forever. Infinity, you have taken resolution. Bonds, you have done a bond signature with Maya. I can stay forever with you. No? Then why not taking preparation? Taking preparation. You have to take anyhow. No other alternative. No other way out. You cannot say me even a single way. If not today, you have some biasness. If you are not today ready, then after maybe one crore years after, you will have to. This way. No other way. If today you are going to reject, okay. 
But someday, after even one crores of year, or two crores, five crores, same way will have to come. Why? Same way, no other way. No other way of coming. So, Prabhupada is explaining that Brahma having four, four head, so much brain, we have this much brain. You open the brain, Einstein, his brain was open. See how much speciality there. Some speciality was found with the brain. It is kept, na? It is kept, na? <laughs> he can understand how capacity, thinking power, he can transcend. Why he can go? A material scientist, he can transcend matter and go and think. Whereas we Vaishnavas cannot think. Is our weakness. How? He can understand what is written in our Chandi. How, I wonder how it is possible for him, a German scientist, to realize what is there, already there in our Shastra, whereas nobody could realize. He was the only man all around the world. He could realize. I am not speaking about those Sadhu Guru, except that material world. He was only. What is the reason? That all infinite world is the manifestation I mean, a deformation of Shakti of Bhagavan. Each and everywhere, energy. Energy, in the uh, energy all converted into matter. Follow. That is same thing written in Chandi. Before Durga Puja, from Agam, Nigam, so many li literatures we have. So one Chandi part, morning time. Before Durga coming, Durga Devi Puja, it is a custom. There is Chandi part. Ya Devi Sarva Bhuteshu Shakti Rupena Sangasthita Namastasai 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 Namo Namaha Ya Devi Sarva Bhuteshu Matri Rupena Sangasthita Namastasai 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 Namo Namaha Dhanam Dehi, Janam Dehi, Yasho Dehi, Disho Johi, all prayer going on. But that point Einstein could understand. The all manifestation of the power. How possible? But nobody could realize. E is equal to MC square. I, I am thinking how possible? How he can realize? Energy released by any mass. Weight of the mass multiplied by the uh, square of the velocity of light and Planck constant. How possible? It's possible. How? Quantum theory advanced, you know. So this way, Brahma thinking with four hair, four head, but still cannot make any head and tail. Bhagavan speaking, well, you cannot understand. I am going to speak. Jnanam, Paramam, Gujyam, Yad, Vigyanasam, all with scientific knowledge. Jnanam, Paramam, Gujyam, Yad, Vigyanasam, Nitham, together with science. Only I know knowledge theoretically. When I am going to apply this knowledge in my field, that practical knowledge. I know I study books, everything, but that is theoretical knowledge. When I can apply, similarly in bhajan life, when you are hearing, reading book, okay, you read. But when you are going to apply all what you are hearing in your own life, that is called practical, practical bhajan. If you cannot apply, then what is the utility? No utility. So, this way, Bhagavan speaking, I can speak to you, then and only then you can understand. If I am not going to speak, you cannot get it. By your force, power, you cannot. Prabhupada speaking, that this way, Brahma finally took decision to submit unto the lotus feet of Bhagavan. The last sloka, like the last, like the last sloka by Arjun, can prove his 100% submission. What I mean to say here, in Gita beginning, in the Gita beginning, you can discover Arjun speaking, well, uh, you can teach me. I am your student. I am a shisha. In the beginning of Gita, second chapter, you can. Oh, you can teach me. You can teach me. I am your student. But verbally speaking, 
But actually, by that time, he is not going to prove that he is 100% surrender. He is speaking. Swadhi maam tvam prapanyam. Swadhi maam tvam prapanyam. You teach me. I, I, am, I, I submit unto you. But that was not actual submit. Actual submit means no doubt, no suspicion, no nothing fighting mood can erase. So by that time, Arjun still not in such a position. Arjun asking question, hey, you are speaking this way, then how I can believe? No, 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 no. You are speaking this way, how I can accept it? Your judgment. That means you have some doubt. But that Arjun, when finally going the end of Gita, end of Gita, when everything, Vishwarup, all cosmic manifestation, everything, watching, oh, infinity world. Arjun wanted to see, I want to see your Vishwarup, cosmic manifestation, everything, in your body, everything. Oh, you like to see, but these eyes you cannot see. I am going to give you some special eyes. After that, Arjun watching, infinity star, planet, what is happening? Oh, Arjun is so mighty man, powerful, but still fear. Then Arjun speaking, oh, stop it, stop it, stop it. I don't like to see. You told me you like to see. And I saw. Then Arjun speaking, I don't like to see. Proceed, proceed, Jagannath. Hey, Jagannath, proceed, you become satisfied. I don't like to see. Very fearful. Because Arjun wanted to, wanted to see everything. Arjun see how I can fight with my uh, grandfather, grand, is impossible for me. Bhagavan see you fighting or I am fighting? Who fighting? You fighting? You see, already they are dead body. All those who are, you think you are going to die, kill them, I, I already arranged. They are, all they are hanging. In my mouth. Whole Mahakal. Kal means time. Kal means in Sanskrit or Bengali, what do you, give, what do you say? Kal. Kal means time. Time and tide wait for none. For infinity period time flowing. Infinity period time flowing. Somebody wanted to put question to Einstein. What do you mean by time? What do you mean by time? Answer, Einstein told, time is nothing but movement. Really so? This is because this co cosmic relative world moving. All, all, everything. All in mobile condition. Star, planet, sun, moon, you, me, who not, everybody in this, all is mobile condition. But you cannot realize. Time is nothing but movement. And now, if time is nothing but movement, then who or what can move? That question comes. A movement, you say, movement to somebody need to move. Then the question of some object coming. And how far or how much can move? Then the question of space coming. So time, space and matter, all interrelated in this material world. Time, space and matter, totally interrelated in matter. You cannot understand. You will have to realize someday. But in this time factor, what you are calculating here, that time factor is not applicable in Aprahi Vaikuntha. That is not a, you are watching, oh, now it's 11 o'clock. But that time is obsolete. In Aprakit Jagat, this kind of t you know, time is not applicable. That is called eternally present. Present time. All. You cannot realize that present. Bhakti Muntra was writing in Jaiva Dharma. Someday, in course of doing Harinam, if Bhagavan is going to best to keep on you, surely you can realize. And now it is one kind of, uh, one kind of gossiping, one kind of fairy tale. I can give one example you can realize. Suppose somebody, material man, fighting. Huh? How possible? You say, Radharani coming from house, home, a job gown, now going to Kusum Sarabar, after collecting flour from there, coming again to Radha Kund, and from Radha Kund go to home, cooking everything for Surya Narayan Bhagavan, going to Surya Kund, and after that coming to... 
Oh, Maharaj, useless. How possible? So long distance. How possible? Eh? Rather than going, Jabgaon is how much? Kusum Sarabara in Jabgaon, how much kilometer? Eh? Minimum 80 or 100 kilometers. 80 kilometers. How possible? It's coming and going. That thing. A Krishna in Nandagraon, from Nandagraon, how possible to come to Vrindavan, 80 kilometers away? Eh? They are applying their material brain. They are applying their material brain, this, but material brain is obsolete. They don't know. They like to apply your own brain. That's why I told you, huh? you try to leave this brain. is useless. That's why Prabhupada told to Swadhananda Swami, first when he came first in front of him, whatever certificate you have, whatever educational qualification you have gathered, you have or doctorate, everything, you can do one thing, you tear up everything in, into pieces and throw in the ocean, a Pacific Ocean, and then you come to me. You throw everything, all useless. With this knowledge, you cannot come to me. You throw everything fast. After that, you come to me, you are going to start your new life. Now, you are going to start your new life. Actually, Diksha means new life. You don't know. It is written in Sastra. Diksha means, Dibhogyan is when new life. You are getting a new birth. Follow. It is new birth. So, people, they are very much interested to apply their brain. But they don't know the calculation of your time, space and matter is applicable in this relative world, not in Aprakita Jagat. They forget this point. They like to apply it. But Simati Radharani is not ordinary lady like you. So how you can expect that material time is applicable for Simati Radharani? Simati Radharani with, only with serving mood approaching. He has no knowledge what time is now, how far I am moving. Automatically. It's an automatic factor. Noon time, I can give example how in Gambira Mandir, thousands of people come. How accommodation there? No fighting. Because Dharma is like a flower. Lotus flower. It is written. You have, da you have seen the picture of Navadip Dham? Picture? Nine petals. So, like lotus flower, if expressing in full form, full, eh? full form, full bloom form. In that case, big. When the Padma pulls in the evening time, going to squeeze. This way, Dharma, Dharma, if you apply some material distance, it's not possible. All controlled by Maya. Srimati Radharani and Gopikas, they are running. They are busy with the serving mood, but where time, space and matter under the control of Yogamaya. They are moving. They don't understand. We reach already. When they come back, they are not calculating, absorbing in Krishna Bhajan, Krishna Seva. They cannot calculate. They are not like miles, miles, we are using a milestone or in our car also, how much mileage, but this is not applicable here. Is automatically Yogumaya arranging everything, Aprakita time. Time, space and matter, all Aprakita. So, Brahma first of all wanted to apply his brain, but now failure, after Bhagavan speaking, who am I? Who am I? How I am? What is my purpose? Uh, uh, what is my Leela? Everything. By your personal effort, you can never understand. You will have to depend upon me. Kripa. So, this way, this way you see, yesterday I told many, many illiterate personalities, they were successful to get the lotus feet of Bhagavan. Whereas all knowledgeable personalities, they are failure. They are failure. That's why, Bhagavan wanted to give this example. That's why Bhagavan wanted to give this example 
I already told the Lama I can recite for your enjoyment, my Aprakita enjoyment. Bhagavan speaking, only and only by the power of satsanga. Only and only. They are not doing. They are not going Veda, Vedanta, not been, not, they have never been to Gurukul, nothing. They have not taken any bow in their life or asceticism, and penances, nothing. Or donation or any, uh, uh, anything. Not that. Bhagavan speaking, only by the help of satsanga, they were successful. Externally, they are all filled up with Rajagun, Tamagun. Externally, they are filled with Rajagun, Tamagun. But still, only by the associations are free. How possible? So, Sadhu Sangha, Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Saste Kwai, Loba Matto, Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Siddhi Hoi. Loba Matto means one second divided by eleven. That much time is more than sufficient to get the lotus feet of Bhagavan. Sarva Siddhi Hoi, Sarva Siddhi means any kind of Siddhi. Bhakti Matagur is explaining any kind of Siddhi means. Even Prema Bhakti, crores of years we are travelling, cannot get one drop of Bhakti. Rupa Krishna we are writing Kirtan, so nice Kirtan. Bhagavan, one drop, cannot, Brahma, Sankar, they cannot see. You please give a glimpse of Bhagavan, busy, not so easy. Somehow, sometime Bhagavan showing the lotus feet. Sankar Bhagavan start dancing this way. A kirtan, you must do kirtan, this kirtan. Krishna Deva Bhavantam Bande, Hari Deva Bhavantam Bande, Jadda Pishama Dishu Vidira Pipashati, Natabana Kagramarichim, Idami Chami Nisham Tabachuta. Tadapi kipad bhuta bichim, Krishna deva bhavantam bande, Hari deva bhavantam bande, Hari deva bhavantam bande. Very nice. Rupa Goswami was writing. So, it is very rare. Prema Bhakti is the topmost treasure. We all Jivatmas, we can expect under the guidance of we are not hopeless. If we are hopeless, why can we can come? We surely are not hopeless. We have hope because we know our Guru was so powerful, Prabhupada, Bhakti Thakur. If if beast and bird they are getting we they are actually demon, rakshas. They can, you cannot get, simply because you are from outside? No. Outside your body. Body taking bath, you are not outside. You can think you are from this land. Never think. This is not your identity. So if one demon, uh, rakshas, they can get, I cannot get. I can also get. So we should keep hope. We are not hopeless. So Bhagavan speaking, Satsangi nahi daitya jatu dhana mega khagaha Gandharabhav saraso nagaha Siddhyas charana guhya kaha Vidyadhara manusseshu vaishyaha Shudraha striyo antayaha Rajastrama prakritayu tasmin tasmin yugi anaga He udhav he has sin-free personality. Time to time, many such incidents happen. What happened? Bala bahabhu mat padam praptya trashta kaya dhava dayuhu vrishya parava balirvano mayascha tabivishanaha shugribyo hunivan nikshu gajo griddho banika pataha vyadaha kubhya vrije gopyo jagya patnas tatha pare. Te Nādhitaha, te nādhito sutigana, nopāsita mahatta maha, abrata tapta tapasa, 
सत्संगयात्मा उमा उपागत भगवान स्पीकिंग बहुबो मत्पद प्राप्त दृष्टा कयाधवाद वृषपर्व बलिर्वाण मयश्चात विभीषण सुग्रीव हनुमान वृक्षो गजो गृद्धो वनिकोपत व्याद कुब्जा व्रजी गोपो यज्ञपत्न तथा परी तेनाधीत श्रुतिगण नोपासी तो महत्तम अव्रता तप्त तपसो सत्संगत्मा उपागत बहुबो मेनी मेनी सच एग्जाम्पल आई कैन गिव यू भगवान श्री कृष्ण स्पीकिंग मेनी सच एग्जाम्पल आई कैन गिव यू बहुबो मत पदम प्राप्त दे दे एटेंडेड माय लोटस फीट बहुबो मत पद त्रास्टो त्रास्टो त्रस्टा यू नो कया धव त्रास्टो मीन त्रस्टा नंदन वृत्तासुर यू हैव टू है यू मस्ट हैव वास्ट नॉलेज अदरवाइज यू कैन नॉट रियलाइज इमीडिएटली आई से वृत्त वो हुई वृत्त देन यू नॉट पॉसिबल वास्ट नॉलेज बैकग्राउंड शुड बी देयर देन यू कैन गेट फैसिलिटी बिग फैसिलिटी सो त्रास्टो मीन त्रस्टा नंदन You can remember I told you, na, that that day, first day I told. What is the reaction of karma kanda? I told what is the result of Brahm, uh, 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 Indra Maharaj. You can remember, na? You forget. <laughs> I know you forget. Cannot remember. How Indra Maharaj fighting? There is no solution. material people in this material world in this material world people are searching solution in this material world people they are always searching people they are always searching solution in this material world but there is no solution unnecessary you are giving energy but you will have to try to cut your karma fall you cannot stop doing but you should make it favorable In favor of Bhagavan. So, trusto, trustan and then he was bittasur, was demon. Trusta kaya thava the yuhu, kaya dhu and then kaya dhu who, mother of Pralad Maharaj. Mother of Pralad Maharaj is kaya dhu. Follow, mother. So kaya dhu and then mean Pralad Maharaj. कया धवा दयु दयामिन प्लूरल एक्सेट्रा कयाधु नंदन प्रहलाद एक्सेट्रा 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 मीन ऑल्सो दे इज ग्रैंड सॉन बली महाराज ऑल्सो दे आर डेमोन ना दे हैव टेकन बर्थ इन डेमोन रेस सो त्रस्ट कया धवा दयु विश्व पर्वा हाउ दे आर फ्री फ्रॉम How they become free from all contamination? That I can explain one by one tomorrow. How? What is the case with Bishapar? Uh, a what with with Trasto, Kaya Dhunandan, Pallad Maharaj, Bishaparva, Pali Maharaj, Ban, Mayas Chauta Bibishan. Bibishan is Rakshas. विभीषण टूक बाद इन राक्षस ना बिकॉज रावण इज राक्षस रावण टूक बाद इन राक्षस कुल तो ब्रादर ऑफ रावण इज विभीषण दे ऑल्सो इन द सेम रेस बोलो सुग्रीव दे आर बीस्ट एक्चुअली मांकी सुग्रीव हनुमान जी महाराज निक्ष निक्ष मीन Uh, that you know, uh, Jambuban. In the name of Jambuban, that Jambu Kashmir you say, no Jambu Kashmir you heard the name Jambu. In his name, I went there in the cave of Jambu, Jambuban. He is the incarnation of Brahma. Hanuman Ji Maharaj is the incarnation of Mahadev Shankar. Nobody knows. So. Bishwaparva is the son of Pralad Maharaj. Bishwaparva, 
Boli, Maharaj is the grandson of Prahlad Maharaj. Follow. Mayo, Mayo Danov is a demon. Danov, big powerful, Udi Pap. Big powerful Maidano is knowing all black magic. He is going to make black magic now. A big problem. There is no so many things. They can know, they know all technique. Tantra, Mantra, Sarajanta, everything. But that also Bali was successful to attain Brahma path. Bibishan, Shugrib, Hanuman, Nriksha, Jambuban. I mean the incarnation of Gajo, Gajendra. You know Gajendra? You heard the name of Gajendra, no? Gajendra Mukshan, you heard? Eight ka hai. Gajendra, I mean elephant. Gajendra Mukshan, Gajendra also got. Hmm? Hanuman, Gajo, Gidho, Gidraj. Gidraj means, actually, he was the friend of the Surajji Maharaj. Follow. Jatayu. You heard the name of Jatayu? When Ravan is going to abduct Sita uh, and going to put her in a chariot from flying, then Jatayu is going to, eh? Eh? He's going to abduct Ravan and going to fly in the sky and fight. Fight, big fighting there. But finally, Ravan was very powerful. So, getting, uh, taking out the sword, and cutting one wing, one wing cutting. There's Jatayu, no more can fight because this one wing gone, he fall down on grind and waiting for Ram or Lakshan to come. Somehow going to manage his life, protect. But some somehow waiting for Ram or to give the information that Sita is abduct, abducted by Ravan. You arrange something. Follow. So that Jatayu also got the darshan of Ramchandan Kipa. You can imagine simply because he wanted to serve Ramchandra, to save his Sakti, he was successful to attain the lap of Ramchandra. When Ramchandra, in course of traveling inside forest, going to meet, he was watching Jatayu. Is the uncle, I mean the friend of my father. How you meet this condition? Wait, wait. After that, going to speak all in details. Tears rolling down his cheeks and speaking. Now, Sita Ma, Sita Devi abducted by her. What do you say? Yes, abducted. He gone, flying here. You are in something. Surely. Then, Ramchandra asking, before you leaving your body, what do you want? I can give everything. I want nothing. You want something, I can give. Because he is Supreme Lord, Ramchandra. Then taking the body of, taking the body of Jatayu in the lap. Dead body. Like Mahaprabhu taking the body of Haridas. You see the mercy of Bhagavan. We are really merciless. We are heartless. That's why you cannot do a bhajan of Bhagavan. If we know the mercy of Bhagavan, then our heart can break down, melt. How is that possible we cannot do bhajan of Bhagavan? Ramchandra taking the body of Yatayu in the own lap and shedding tears. Taking the body in lap and as if as if Ramchandra doing Abhishek, you know Abhishek? At that, at, Abhishek you don't know. When I am doing Shiva, uh, Pratishta, doing water, card, milk, that is called Abhishek. Abhishek you don't know. Then what I can do? Abhishek. As if Ramchandra doing, making Abhishek out of his tears. As if Ramchandra making a Prakita Abhishek by his tears. Whole body, full of years. After that, taking the body and going to crematorium ground, crematorium they make one arrangement like father, like son, one son in Vedic culture, when father leave body, going to leave body, 
then son need to son need to carry the body in the cremation cremation ground, and he is the first to give to give fire in the mouth. Take one stick, glowing glowing stick, and give the fire in the mouth first. After whole body, follow. There is the Vedic culture, niyam. Son must. If there is no son, somebody have no son, only daughter. Then what to do? They can. Uh, then somehow can arrange if there is good relationship. Son-in-law can do, or the son or brother. Maybe that man has no son. Maybe the, his brother has son. They can do somehow. Uh, who has nobody? What to do? So Ramchandra, like own father, Ramchandra giving the honor. Try to understand. Ramchandra, see Ramchandra giving the honor just like father. Just like father. Like, like Mahaprabhu, when father gone, going to crematory and guy and put the body, give fire to father. All like human being. All like human being. Similarly, you see, Ramchandra going to do all ritualistic activities, funeral uh, activities, after that, whatever need to do according to Rishi. Vedic culture, Ramchandra done everything, like father. What is the relationship between devotee and Bhagavan? You cannot develop. If I go on speaking so many things, time can over. I cannot finish. There in before before Katwa, there is one place. I went. Govindo Goshi part was the eternal parsad of Gauranga Mahap. Eternal parsad. Follow. So loveful relationship with Bhagavan. He used to worship Gopinath. He used to worship Gopinath. And Someday he is lamenting, I have no children, nothing. Who can do my last activity? Funeral. Gopina deity, deity, Gopina speaking. Don't think I can do. Gopina speaking. What is the duty of son? That I can do myself. Really? You can do? Yes. Really so. This incident is famous, everybody knows. When? Govinda goes, you find Kirtan in Chaitanya, Govinda goes. Basu goes, Govinda goes, you find his name. In Chaitanya, every day, every day, no excuse. Wherever you stay, you will have to read at least one page of Chaitanya Bhagavad. At least one. No excuse. I have no time, nothing. I, can, I don't like to hear. Even you stop your reading and sleeping, you must read one page. Bhakti, it is a suggestion of Bhakti Thakur. Govinda goes, left body. So who can do funeral activities? Who? Gopinath from deity coming out. Gopinath himself, Bhagavan coming out from deity and going to a uh, cemetery ground, do everything. And after that, wearing some special clothes we'll have to wear. Father gone, white. Doing all sadha, all done by Gopinath. Everybody knows. Famous in this very famous, everybody know, all village men, they know. Gopina, they appear. I promise you, I can act as your son. I can do sradhya, everything, Gopina done. But we have no faith. That is the main problem, we have no faith in Guru Vaishnava. If you can do satsanga from heart, I can promise you in written that you can come out successful. Provided there is no duplicity in your life, you can come out successful. Otherwise, no way out. Only and only. Guru Vaishnava, they are the only support in our life. False ego try to throw away any kind of, even unmindfully, we are going to protect some false ego. I am nothing. I am nothing even when we are doing pranam, we like to become the dust particle unto a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava. We are speaking this way, but actually we don't ever want. So this way, 
today up to this point i like to stop here and uh, sadhu sangha is excellent what not possible by sadhu sangha one by one i can go on discussing only by sadhu sangha they are successful अथापिते पदाबुजतो प्रसाद लेश अनुगृहत ही जानाति तथ्यम भगवान महिमो न च एक चिरंग विचिन्म वाचकल्पतरो पति तान पावन भो विष्णु नमः